Welcome to Amazing You, where we're going to reclaim your identity, step into your power, and activate your soul's purpose. I'm your host, Dr. Alicia Antica. You can find my programs, courses, books, and trainings at lishaantica.com. Let's get started. So take some breaths, deepen your breaths, get comfortable right now. You can find a place to lay down, you can sit down, you can stay. Just joining the screen here. Hmm. Feel your breath. And begin in noticing your body, noticing the body, noticing the skin you're in. Feel the skin you're in. Thank you for the love, Miss Julia. Your appreciation and gratitude, you guys, mean so much to me. I know it's like a penny or something that I might get per rose, but it definitely, it, it motivates me. It helps me. It, I love that. Um, so I just want you to know that, you know, more than than the income or anything, like it's it gives me energy and I appreciate you appreciating me. All right. Inhale, feel your breath. Stretching up and exhale. <sighs> you can bring your hand to your belly and just breathe deep into your belly. Inhale, arms up. And exhale. <sighs> Inhale, arms up. And exhale. <sighs> And just rock back. And if you're if you're laying down, you can just kind of go side to side, or you can bring your heels into your your bum and lift your hips up a little bit, and just move your spine back and forth. You can do it on your bed. You can do it lying down. You're just moving your spine and your neck. You're kind of letting it go in these waves, but you can do it from a bridge position, and it just feels so good. Right, so you can do that. You can go forward and backwards. I'm gonna go forward and backward. Inhale and exhale, just moving your spine. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Feeling your spine, moving your spine. Feeling your body. So we're starting to unwind the nervous system. In all of my programs, I use yoga. Yoga saved my life many times over. My mom's too. Inhale up. Ah, oh, Cynthia, I love those. Thank you. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Now we're going to bring the hands and the arms can go up here. The arms can be down or I bring thumbs back, fingers forward. You're going to inhale left, exhale right. Just little twists. You don't want any pain. Just feel your breath, inhaling and exhaling. And pull in your belly and just feel that exhale being pushed out. Work in this adrenals, kidney area. Inhale up, hold your breath on top, 
and exhale. And then we're gonna roll the neck, opening up the brain, opening up the head, opening up the neck, inhaling and exhaling. Yes. Thank you for sharing, Miss Julia. And switch the other way. We're going to shift our stories tonight, telling ourselves a different story, honoring those splits, honoring those flashbacks, honoring that we survived, validating how we got through it, and validating the brain's new story and how it wants to get through it. For so many years, I wanted to bite tongues off. Inhale, arms up. And exhale. I totally forgot to inhale and exhale. See, it happens sometimes. It's okay. Inhale. Hold your breath on top. And exhale. So because it's nighttime, we're going to do separate nostril breathing. And um, this is going to kind of get your head back on straight, get everything on straight. This is excellent, excellent to do at night. I do it most every night as I'm laying in bed. All right, so you're going to take your hand, oh, excuse me, and close your right nostril. Inhale. Holding, switch, close your left nostril and exhale through your right. Now you're going to inhale through your right. Close and exhale. Inhale. Close and exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Keep going a few more. Inhale. Thank you, Amanda. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. And then inhale. Hold your breath on top. And exhale. Beautiful. So go ahead and just feel your body. So we're going to go through, if you haven't been in one of my lives, I heal, I'm a trauma therapist, and I heal through the limbs of consciousness. So I've studied consciousness. And um, mm, Yes, you can go to the chiropractor and get a balloon in your nose. I was talking about that before. <laughs> yeah, and obviously if you have um, never done that or one side is less, go ahead and use your breath. You don't want to go not breathing. Oh, beautiful. Yes, Amanda, you should feel that relaxation. All right, so I'm going to, I'm just beginning this. We're going to open up the Reiki. If this is something that aligns with you. Go ahead and uh, receive. You always have the right to receive this support or not. Feeling that. And 
And first we're going to work with a physical body. So your physical body, when you went through that trauma, it is unwinding. So when we flash back, the physical body doesn't know that it's not there. So oftentimes we start doing things. We can harm people, harm ourselves, hurt people. We kind of black out as we time travel into our PTSD. So let's exhale, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Dissolve, resolve, good morning, Roger. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. And visualize that line of energy straight from your forehead, straight from your body into your soul star, all the way up into heaven. However you relate to heaven, so visualize, see heaven, God, source above you. Open up to receive that. Ask for that supply. Ask for that support. Call on your highest good and visualize golden light just coming down upon you, opening through your crown, into your brain, into your third eye, through your, your skin, into your eyes into your jaw, into your bones, down through your nervous system, down through your shoulders, letting go of your day, down through your arms, through your hands, through your body, all the way down through your body, breathing into your heart, into your ribs, into your guts, into all of your organs, all the way down into your guts, and at the base of your tailbone, there's a drain. Go ahead and pull that plug and release. Release anything physically that you've held on to, anything you've picked up from anybody else today. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that down through your legs. And visualize like your, your perineum, that, that muscle that you lift when you do a Kegel or stop the flow of urine, your perineum just releasing and this light just releasing anything down through as you anchor, anchor, anchor into your grid spot. Reclaim your spot on this planet. So if you've moved over today, if you've given up your spot, if you've time traveled in that PTSD, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. If you've made up stories, made up things, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. If your brain has Yes, from anxiety, just let it go. And anchor into your spot. Feel rooted and grounded through your feet. And let's dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend anything else that's in the way there. Let it go. So as a transpersonal therapist, I have studied things like angel counseling and yoga and nutrition and prayer and and soul healing and the trinity and ancient religions dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend and energy healing right and all these modalities that transcend trauma in different ways and i've done all of this from a trauma perspective since i was 20. so i began this journey studying this certifying myself in this not myself but you know getting certified in it <sighs> since i was in my 20s and then I became a doctor. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. And wrote dissertations and books and studied it on different levels. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. So I speak in tongues. I have since I was eight. I use my clairvoyant, clairsentient gifts. I use Reiki to help you transcend the story of your trauma. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. But I also use your ability to know your body. So bring your attention, your focus into your body now and what you're feeling. So there's tension maybe in your shoulders. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. And the cool thing that we found about Reiki is 
that really TikTok taught me, but I've also, I was doing Zoom calls, so I don't know why it didn't translate, but it works. It works through space and time, just like PTSD. So PTSD or splitting um, or um, time travel in that way is, is really about energy, right? So it's that same beyond time and space. You can heal that. So let's tell your body, go ahead and bring your focus and your attention to any place you might be holding that PTSD. Maybe you have it in like your mouth. Maybe for me, like I was sexually abused, right? So I wanted to bite and hit and mm, right? Um, if you've been in war, maybe you want to like fight back and everything. Give voice to that, right? You're not in a panic attack. You don't have to know what happened to you. Just give that dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend all of that. Feel it in your body, however your body is expressing that. Maybe it's cancer, maybe it's fibromyalgia. Feel it in your body. So we'll get to the agoraphobia here in a minute. But feel it how your body's expressing it. Physical pain, joint pain, anything that's holding on to that PTSD that's telling a different story, right? So any place where your body is altering facts to plagiarize your story, your time, the current time, 2023, any time, any of that plagiarism there, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. That's what PTSD does, right? It plagiarizes time. It says, oh, you're back in time. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Releasing that. From the physical self, let's release any place that your body is still holding on to old memories, trying to solve them. And let's just bring affirmation into it. Just bring affirmation into it. Yes, I love the mic. Just bring affirmation into it. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. That's my favorite so far, I think, is the mic of the little ones. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend. All right, so keep inviting this golden light into your body. Inviting that golden light into your body. Invite that golden light into your body to heal the stories, to heal this. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. So PTSD, CPTSD, BPD, reactive abuse, okay? Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend how the body takes over and puts us in those states of not being present. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend. How that hurts, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend. All right, feel your breath, let it go. All right, any place where your body is locked up, it's not moving, breathe into those areas. Exhale, let it go. Feel it root and ground, releasing anything down that drain. Begin feeling your body move. Beautiful. All right, we're going to move to the next level that we store trauma, which is in our brains, your thoughts, your beliefs, okay? So the brain also circles, 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 circles the, the trauma, right? That's the PTSD. The brain keeps it and it's like, oh, I'm going to solve it tomorrow. Usually we get PTSD six months to, to a year after we've survived. Okay. And then if you're still living it, then it just cycles and cycles and cycles for the CPTSD. So Breathe into that. That's why things kind of get worse before they get better as you're on your healing journey sometimes, okay? 
if you just got out of abuse, if you just got out of abuse, but the thing is, is you can heal PTSD by letting it unwind. So let's release it through our brain. Yes, we're gonna work that limbic system. It is right here, all right? It's right here, we are gonna work the amygdala tonight. So you can take your hands and just rub your scalp. Yes, I love Sea of Gems that you said, the um, limbic system, I love it. And the gravity reflex system too, you guys, we're resetting those. So go ahead and just like breathe into it. Notice if you're holding your breath and notice where your thoughts are this evening. Where are your thoughts? Are they in the past? Are they in the future? Can you bring them into the present? Bring them into the present with your breath. And if you can, close your eyes if it's safe and roll your eyes up into your head and look back towards your third eye, right there in the third eye. Breathe into it, focus on that third eye and there's space there, feel that opening. We're anchoring it in here. baby cakes um you left cream here my moisturizer yeah it's for it's it's yours yeah you have mm -hmm. it's on the counter there Thank you. so just feel now go ahead and just take take your hands and press them right in between your jaw and your ear okay and just massage that spot you can go like that. Let's massage that spot. You can also work through the sides of your brain. Right about here, this is your survival brain. And then, of course, your limbic brain, which is in the back. Focus there and just give some extra light there. Okay? Tell it to calm down. Focus on your breath. And we're just gonna unwind some of these stories a little bit. We're just gonna unwind some of these stories that you've been telling yourself so you don't have to split, so you don't have to time travel anymore. And so you can see yourself when you do that. So you can see yourself when you time travel just a little bit. Having that awareness. Hello. Hello, Miss Stacy. Yeah. If you're getting kicked out, mm, sorry about that, but we're just gonna keep going and just come right back in. So this is the anger, this is the story, this is the confusion. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Whew. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Let it go, let it go, let it go. So bring yourself into the moment, into this present moment. Notice five things around you. Notice this present moment. Where are you? What stories are you telling yourself? How can you tell yourself a story of love, of light, of hope, of joy? That you are whole, that you survived, that you are plenty, that you are enough, that you are good, that you are clean, that you won that battle. Tell yourself the story that you've grown up, that you got out of that situation, that you don't have to time travel back to it anymore. Tell yourself, tell yourself. Yeah. Honor each of those places that you travel to, each of those places, right? I honor my two-year-old that survived. I honor my 
seven year old that survived. I own my 11 year old that survived my 16 year old that survived. Those are the ages that I got stuck at as I healed, right? Those are the ages that I'd flash back to when I had my PTSD, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Those are the ages that are reverted to. Tell your brain you survived. Congratulate those ages. See those ages, validate your ages, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, validate your story, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute. Look at all the things you survived. Look how beautiful and wonderful you are. Feel that opening to God's source. Feel that opening your crown. Good job. Now feel that anchoring into heaven. Feel that line anchoring into heaven and see these things go down to dissolve, resolve, transform all any negative bad thoughts. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend. Now, the thoughts themselves, the memories might not go away, but are you willing to let go of the energy they hold? Just the energy, just the free, free yourself as much as is available to you tonight. As much as feels safe, just free yourself. Let it go down that drain from as much as it feels safe, down that drain from the trigger, from the vibration, the fear of the present moment that that was. Okay, let's validate the present moment of terror, the present moment of dislike, the present moment of, of defensiveness, the present moment of rage, the present moment of any of that emotion. <sighs> Disappointment, <sighs> shame, <sighs> guilt, <sighs> false blame, <sighs> all of that. Just let go of that triggered emotion. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that from your brain, from the storyline. You still remember the memory. You're just letting go of the energy of that story. And no longer, it doesn't even, it's not even valid. The energy doesn't need to be there. That PTSD doesn't need to be there anymore because you already experienced it and you already survived. Okay, so your brain just needs to know it already survived. Feel it go down the drain. That's it. Now feel that be filled up, filled up with I already survived, filled up with your age. Now filled up with this awareness of this present moment, filled up with this present moment, filled up with this present moment and just feel that. So go ahead and ask your higher self, ask God, ask the angels, ask that love instance to come in and bring you abundance and peace and the confidence that you already survived. You already survived. Who cares if it doesn't look all pretty and perfect, right? Whose life looks pretty and perfect? Even if you're rich and famous, it's not pretty and perfect. Dissolve, resolve, transform. We live off their drama. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, transcend that. Yeah, beautiful. All right, so we're going to move into the emotional body. Goodbye, Alaska native. Love you. <laughs> so um, we're going to breathe into your emotional body. So letting the brain go, just let it be. Let all those thoughts just go down. All right, feel your breath. Just feel your emotions. So the emotional body and the mental body, we get caught up. So if you haven't been in my lives before, the emotional body and the mental body, we get caught up, right? So oftentimes we have PTSD in our emotional body, especially if you reflect in things like BPD, okay? And, and you've suffered from anything like BPD or bipolar manic episodes, okay? Manic or depressive episodes. So all that that is, when that comes into the, to the emotion, you might be flooded with emotion, right? We get anxiety, we get depression, right? When, when we have our PTSD, right? I get vomity immediately. I feel like I'm going to puke. So just feel that, notice that, notice what comes up and let's release any excess energy from your emotional body, right? That is stuck back there in time and the ages that you were, when you were hurt, when you survived the war, when you served our country, when you were raped, when you were hurt, when you were in that narcissistic or abusive relationship, right? When you were being molested, dissolve, resolve, transform, whatever you have PTSD from that car accident, release that. 
so you can think through it so you can feel it yes i do have cash app and if you'd like to to donate it is um dr lisha antica dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend that dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend that okay feel it go down 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 that drain dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend that opening up your back opening up your back so i'm feeling this a lot of tension in your lower back so i'm just going to massage that intention out bring your awareness we hold a lot of emotion in our thighs and our hips and our shoulders and our and um you know for men it's it's shoulders more for women it's hips more and thighs right so strong muscles so dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend wherever that is for you breathe into those areas now if you've been holding that energy of your emotions and you're altering facts to make, like maybe you exaggerate things or, or you minimize things, right? We do one or the other, you guys, all of us do. So do you exaggerate things or do you minimize things, right? Is your emotions exaggerated? Can you not handle them? Or do you pretend like you don't have any emotions at all? Let's release that. Dissolve, resume, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Yeah, so little breaths, inhale, little breath, hold and exhale, release. It's a little panic attack. And just feel that energy of that panic attack. Just release down, down, down that tailbone, out your back. Just visualize it. Like God source, just letting it go, letting it go. We have 33 people in here. That is a magic number for me. So see God source, the angels, just release it down your back. Just let it go. Let go of that extra energy of that anxiety dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend that okay any place where your you your body or your emotions are making up tales right we do this when we flash back because what we're flashing back to isn't actually happening sometimes we self-harm sometimes we reenact things sometimes we reenact with people in front of us and it can hurt others some you know all of this stuff can happen so dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend that and forgive yourself invite the energy of forgiveness i'm doing a master class walking you through a healing on forgiveness three layers of forgiveness three classes 97 bucks you guys it's going to be amazing um that is in my link tree dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend oh your wishing bottles thank you cynthia i love you release that dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend that <sighs> beautiful jennifer welcome love dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend that yes feel that going down through you dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend that yes you guys move that energy Feel that energy from God's source from above you. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, transcend that. Let it go. Releasing that PTSD, releasing the CPTSD energy. So you're still going to have that emotion, but you'll be able to recognize it hopefully a little bit more, right? You'll go, oh, there's the anxiety rising up or there's the rage raising up. And then you can direct it. Oh, I can do something healthy with it. With it. Go and talk to your counselor. Find healthy ways to express that that emotion, validate that emotion, but not be taken by it anymore. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend it. <sighs> Releasing that tie that that memory has to you onto your body and feeling it right here in the middle of your heart. Do ta ma sa ke ta ya ha ha. Also right here in the limbic brain, in the back of your brain. Umba ha. We're untying that knot of emotion, that reactivity. Right? So we open to that. Open to, oh, that used to happen and it really affected me and now it didn't. Hmm, curious. Hmm, curious, releasing that. All right, so we are going to reset our nervous system here. We're just going to do a little vagus nerve reset. Go ahead and interlock your fingers. Bring your hands behind your head if you're able. Lift up a little bit and exhale, relax your shoulders down, chins up, and look to the left. Excuse me, look to the right. And you're just gonna hold here. If you've never done this, this is resetting your vagus nerve. You might have to hold this up to three minutes, you guys, until you yawn or take a nice big, big sigh. Don't force it. <sighs> Releasing that. And then whenever you're ready, look forward and then look the other direction, the left. 
and you're gonna hold this until again you sigh now for me it's gonna be fast because I do it every day you can do this every day you can do it multiple times a day my neck just popped that's beautiful after you sigh go ahead and look forward oh good I'm so happy you needed this me too and release Ooh, I just felt that go all the way down my back. Okay. All right. Breathe deep. Exhale. Do you feel calmer now? Yes. Receive that happiness, joy, laughter, peace, and love that James is giving us. You guys receive that. Yes, yes, yes. Jennifer says yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Breathe into that. Receive that peace. And feel the connection between your body and your mind and your emotions. You are not your emotions. You have them. You're not the stories that you tell yourself, you have them. And we do time travel. We call it PTSD. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Breathe into your guts. Let any of that go. Releasing your guts. Relax. Beautiful. Let it go, let it go, let it go, let it go, let it go. And then again, anchor, anchor, anchor your emotional body into your grid spot anchored into your spot this is your life this is your life you deserve to be here you're alive you're worthy dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend all that that is dissolve resolve transform transmute and transcend let it go anchor into you you have a you have emotions you are not your emotions you have emotions right oof 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 all right, now our etheric field. So this is your magnetic field. This is how life either creates you or you create life. We're here to co-create life with God, not with each other, okay? With God, not with each other. So that was a really hard one for me, actually. In, a lot, in some ways, I'm still getting it. In, in a lot of ways, I'm still getting it. I'm still like, oh yeah. It's not about them. It's about me. It's about me and God, right? And my relationship with God. So we go a lot through this. If you're in Amazing You, if you're in the magnetic class, then this is, this. we go through a lot this, right? So fill your magnetic field. Fill it. Fill it. Beautiful. We even have um, affiliates, love. You help promote and we will bless you right back. Um, I'm looking for ambassadors to partner with. So that would be beautiful. So fill your breath. Everything is in on my website or in that link tree that's happening right now. Inhale. Exhale. So around you, film up on you. Go ahead and just take your hands and just kind of create the space around you. Fill the space around you. This is your space. This is your space. This is your space, right? So in our space is our experiences, right? And when we have unresolved experiences where the mind has PTSD and it's just saying, oh, but I have a better solution. I have a way out of that now. Now I know how to do that, right? That's what PTSD, it's the nervous system, the body, the mind, the emotions going, oh, now I can figure my way out. Because what happens when we have trauma is we literally can't figure it out in the moment. It's a trauma, meaning we can't, we don't have a response. So we fight, flight, or freeze, right? But then as the body and the mind and the emotions go, oh, I have a solution for this. I have a solution for this now. Then we get what we call PTSD. And if you don't unwind that PTSD, which Nobody friggin does really. I learned this actually from healing polio and, and studying about polio. Um, but when we unwind it, then we don't have the triggers anymore. So that's what we're doing tonight. We're unwinding it a bit. So you have this magnetic field, just like the TV, just like your phone, just like, like anything else, right? 
this is how you create, this is how you manifest, or this is how your program just keeps creating the same damn thing. So go ahead and take us to bed, Cynthia, and get in bed and relax. Let me put you to sleep here. We're gonna work that electromagnetic field. So just exhale, exhale, exhale. Visualize a bubble around you. Close that bubble around you. Fill your protective shield. If you have, um, you know, if you've been a toxic empath, if you've been a blown out empath, if you've been a people pleaser, if you've been a codependent, then this field is most definitely not formed. So go ahead and put a shield around you. Visualize it. Ask Archangel Michael, Gabriel, Ezekiel to come in and help you build that. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Keep letting everything from this field just go down. All those past experiences that you've already survived, you already lived. Give yourself the validation that you already survived. You already survived. You survived today. You survived yesterday. You survived. You survived the situation. You don't need to experience it again. You don't need to do it again. You already survived. Right? And that's why we have PTSD because part of us felt threatened. So releasing that, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Invite light and love. Invite these beautiful aspects of self into this, right? So any place where you're holding on to an old story, where you're altering facts. Have you ever talked to a kid about their perception? Somebody else has a different, different perception and the adult has a different perception, right? Everybody remembers things differently. So, you know, we all alter facts. So as we go through these memories, we're altering facts. So any altered facts, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Okay. Anything that you're plagiarizing others work. Are you, are you carrying around somebody else's guilt or shame? Right? Should maybe your abuser feel shame and guilt and instead you're carrying it around? If so, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. We're going to pull that right out of your third eye. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Release that story. Release that story. Release that scribe. Release that scribe. Let it go. Let go of the falsehood. And let's preserve knowledge and information. Preserve. Mo yes, let go of that mom stuff. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Preserve. Your knowledge, claim your knowledge, claim your knowledge. Claim your knowledge, feel that come in through your crown, through your crown. And then let's release the storytelling, making up tales that harm others. Whether you were accused of making up tales that harm others, right? or other people have made up tales to harm you, or your tales that you're making up now harm you or harm others, anything. Release that, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Anything, anybody else's tales in, in here that harm you, all the rumors, did you guys have rumors ever spread around you about you? Oh my gosh. My mother loves spreading rumors around me and so did my friends. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Let it go. Ability to experience and express life through stories and symbols. I don't know about you, but I could use some of that. Telling stories are hard for me. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Yeah, let it go, Stacy. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend. All of those other people's stories, those other people's rules, those other people's things, right? If you are over the age of 18, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Make your own decisions. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. If your physical body is over the age of 18, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. All right, let's release any lyrical gift turn to negative or destructive effect any negative talk that you have in your head about yourself and let's express your soul call in your soul call back your soul 
from all those experiences, from all the people that took your soul, that gave you trauma, that, that, that walked you through that experience. Call back your soul, call back your soul, call back your soul, call back all those ages into this present moment. All of them dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Validate them, love them, see them, witness them, claim your story, 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 claim your story. So you can tell your story come home. When Jesus appeared to me when I was 13 and my entire life's changed, right? I turned him in. The whole thing happened. Um, Jesus said, go home and tell. And I have been helping people come home, their souls home into their body, reclaim their lives, work this way and tell their story for decades. And as I say this and I don't tell my story and I don't feel like I tell stories. And even though I've written many books, and I've done so much stuff. I have so much anxiety around this right now. Who is, whose is this? Cause this wasn't mine. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend them. Validate every age. Validate one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88. Did I miss anybody? 88. All the ages. All the ages. Validate, validate, validate. They all survived. You're all surviving. Everybody lives within us. And we're all this age right now. Boom. Claim your age. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. <sighs> claim it, claim it, claim it. Yes, claim 46. Claim it. <sighs> claim your maturity. Claim it, claim it, claim it. And validate, validate all of that. So when you time travel back to it, if you split if you have PTSD, if you flash back, you can recognize that your soul, your essence, your consciousness is in the age that you are presently. And you can look at that flashback and hold it and love it and reparent it and be with it in that moment. <sighs> claim it, claim it, claim it, claim it, claim it. Yes. 1862. Beautiful, beautiful. Yes. <sighs> Yes. Reclaim all of you. Yep. 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 Reclaim all of you. Hunda masaka te amoru no moaka te ase akatoa. O maka se ataya hanaria mona haka te ase akata humaria hate aha. Uaka ta sayaka. Huaka. Huaka. E ala mono yaka te. Su 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 ke. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Expressing soul insights, express your soul insights. Warriors, warriors, my warrior friends, my warrior brothers and sisters, thank you, thank you, thank you. Any place where you have been asked, told, or forced to trade ethical principles for victory at any cost, okay, even to your own psyche, right? And indifference to the suffering inflicted on others or your physical body, right? Like I used to smack the shit out of myself as we were saying earlier, right? Where you're banging your head against the wall. You might self harm. You might make up tales. You might do things, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend all that that is releasing that out of your sphere of wisdom, out of your sphere of knowledge, out, out, out of your sphere. Let it go. 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 Mm. All right. So the warrior. I want you to acknowledge if you've been a warrior, if you have PTSD, that means on some level 
you're a warrior. You've been stuck in that fight, flight, or freeze. You've been stuck in that awareness, right? So you have strength. Let's honor your strength. Honor your strength. Yes, yes, yes. Honor your strength. Those right there, Miss Julia, are infused with special Reiki and deep, deep healing. I prayed over those so much when I made them. Thank you for sharing. Mm-hmm. Call in your strength. Call in your strength. Umpaka. Feel your strength. Acknowledge the strength of every age. Acknowledge that strength. Breathe into your body. Breathe into that. And your skills. Think of all the skills that you have. Acknowledge your skills. Ignite your frontal lobe. Bring your hands to your head. And just receive that light, that light of love, of Christ joy, a peace of love, of harmony of your skills. Fill your skills, fill your skills, fill your skills. Acknowledge your skills, move into your skills. Breathe, relax into your skills, your discipline. Mm, right, if you've been, if you've had PTSD for a bit, you have discipline, acknowledge it. Anybody can do this with your hands. Now, I am trained in Reiki, but anybody can do this with their hands. But ha So have discernment, everybody. Listen to Nikki. Have discernment. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend. And if it doesn't work for you, then let it, let it go. Go ahead and pass me by, love. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Will, and, and then your toughness of will. Your toughness of will. Your ability to survive. Acknowledge, no matter what came into your bu bubble, no matter what came into your bubble, that you have the ability to survive. Yep, Nikki's okay for the moment. Do I have them? any mods on here though? Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. All right, love. There you go. Thank you. Oh, Sky's here too. Perfect. Thank you, hon. So breathe. Yeah, we're releasing a lot here. As soon as I said that, though, we lost some, some people. So we had some people that didn't want. Okay, let's call in heroism. You still are too, Stacey. Yes, you are. So go ahead and call in heroism. Call in heroism. Call in heroism. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Yeah, absolutely, Nikki. That's why nobody did that. But it was good, right? Because we keep this place, space safe. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. And yes. Always giving consent. So at the beginning of this, I said, if you don't give consent, then you don't receive it, right? So you're not going to feel it. I always set up with consent. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend this. Everything I do in here, you guys can do yourself, remember? Dissolve, resolve, transform. I'm just teaching you how and how to walk across this bridge. New thought patterns to release drama and trauma, to release these things. So call in the light. Let's witness your own hero. You are your own hero. Witness all those times that your brain is having PTSD that your body is having PTSD, that your emotions are having PTSD in order to be your hero, right? They're working it out. They're taking you back. They're flashing you back to that time. And then they're trying to fight it out, battle it out, scream it out, defend yourself it out, right? Make up that story. Sometimes you get abused again. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. <sighs> Let it go. So it's more the energy I put behind it, Nikki. Um, study Reiki if it's something that actually interests you. If you're mocking me, then you can leave now, love, and we will mute you, okay? But if you want to learn it, study Reiki and Sozo and Body Lights Therapy, okay? Those, those are the methodologies that, that I've used. 
okay that's what they're called yeah okay so let's also call in self-sacrificing and conquering your ego so self-sacrifice and conquering your ego where have you healed where have you healed where have you conquered your ego beautiful nikki perfect so where have you conquered your ego call that in So it's in the less the hand movements because I really go by like what I'm feeling where the energy is moving and body lights therapy and less of the Reiki moves, which you can study. Okay. Yeah. So we did the, um, we did the Vegas nerve reset just a little bit ago. Go ahead and, um, watch my videos on it, hun. Okay. On my page. Make sure to follow me on my page. I have videos on the Vegas nerve reset. Go and find it and, and do those after this and do it every day. <sighs> All right. So just release that release anything that's ready to be released. Call in that connection to God's source. Feel that energy run down your spine, releasing anything from your bubble. This is your reality bubble. You are a co-creator with God's source, not with anybody else, not with me, not with anybody else, with God's source, right? So that's why we keep recreating our life over and over and over and over again. Let it go to prove that we can survive, to prove that we can do better. No, you're perfect. Hippasun, you're perfect. Yep, you're perfect. You're perfect. You're in the right place, love. You're in the right place on the right on the right page. We're just doing the healing right now. Oh. All right. So last but not least, we're going to we're going to release this femme fatale, this inappropriate use of sensuality attachment to money or power. <sighs> Any place that you've been told this, any guilt that attaches to this, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Any time that you've been made to feel this, dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. And let's call in your beautiful divine feminine power to vault. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend this. Call in your beautiful light. Beautiful, beautiful. I'm seeing purple light. Calling in, calling in, calling in, calling in, calling in. Exhale. Plugging your drain. I want you to fill up. Imagine so imagine the most perfect day. Replay your day now in the most beautiful way. Replay your day now in the most beautiful way. If everything went right today, if everything was smooth, if you rewrote it in your nervous system, if you told yourself a different story, how would you rewrite your day for a calm, peaceful, successful, lovely, 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 lovely day? Ah, good night. Love you, Miss Julia. Thank you so much for joining. So good to see you. Thank you for being a new mod. Ah, hope to hear from you. Dissolve, resolve, transform, transmute, and transcend that. Call in your day. Call in blessings. Call in light. Call in the angels. Good job. And we're just going to close this out. Inhale, arms up. And if you're sitting up, if you're not, just keep laying down, going deeper and deeper into sleep, letting yourself fall asleep. I'm going to stick around to do Q&A, but if you're going to sleep, just go to sleep. Oh, you can stick around too. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale, feel that deep connection within you. Claim your life, claim your energy. This is your life. You have a life, you have electromagnetic fields, you have desires and wants, you are not them. Mm. Call in your soul, claim your soul, claim your, claim these tools. Mm. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right, you guys, <sighs> inhale, arms up, and exhale, 
three times. Inhale, arms up. And exhale. Coming back to center. Inhale, arms up. And bring your hands into your heart. Mm. Thank you, thank you, thank you.